All right, free citizens. We're back down here at the courthouse again to file our next lawsuit with these criminals. And this time we're going to film everything. We're going in here filming. Let's see if they allow this pursuant to the Constitution and the memo that was passed out by Homeland Security. I'm going to record my interactions, uh, my business in this courthouse, which is my right to do so. And let's see if they violate that right. So y'all stand by. Walking up to the courthouse, it's a rainy day. Uh, we came yesterday, and I guess they decided they wanted to take the day off. Then so be it. So we're here today to file these documents. They're already looking out the window. So I guess the guy at the, the booth told him I was coming. What's up, yo, man? I need to see one of y'all supervisors. Okay. No, I'm inside now. guys still not allowing anybody to record in the courthouse? Okay. 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 So we're down here again, and I just asked the uh, front security, and he said, no, they're not allowed. No, I got it. I got it. Are you guys up under the marshals? Yeah, we got the marshals coming. Okay. Yeah. Are you guys familiar with this Homeland Security notice? Don't ask for all that. No, well, I spoke to them before. They say I could. I just I don't want to disrespect you guys. Yeah. That's why I'm gonna make it clear. You know. You know, last time I was here, they took nine summons and affidavits out of my civil lawsuit. So now we're going to record all the interaction, my business with this courthouse. This is the memo uh, that home, the United States Department of Homeland Security sent out saying that we can record in federal buildings, including the courthouse. If not, we'll go back up on Capitol Hill and argue this in the judicial uh, building.
Can you turn the camera on? No, sir. You can't have the camera on a courthouse. That, incorrect. Okay, well, you can't come in with the camera. And you can't bring your camera. Home, Homeland Security said I can come and do bit. I'm doing business in this courthouse. Are you denying me access? This is a memo that Homeland Security put out. I can record my business in the public areas of this courthouse. Okay? The last time I was here, your court clerk of the court took nine summons out of my documents and claimed they couldn't find them. I'm recording my business in this courthouse. Oh, yeah, okay. Well, I'm not going into the courtrooms. I'm recording my business with this courthouse now because there's a corrupt element. And I need to speak to your supervisor. The last time I was here, I checked with the marshals. They said I could do it in the public area. This gives me the right to do it. Okay. Well, I can call Marshall for it if you want. Well, that's what I asked. I asked for the supervisor. Okay. Well, I'm the supervisor. No, the guy's over you all. All right. No, no disrespect to you. I just want to see. I've, I talked to them the last time. Now they're telling me that I can't do business in this courthouse with my constitutional right and a memo from Homeland Security. This is what they do. They cover up. And I'm not saying these guys, this is whoever the chief judge is, they cover up their dirty. And these are the front guys that do it for them. This is how my documents got taken out of my lawsuit. No, he, hey, uh, excuse me, supervisor. Excuse me. Can I get your name? Yeah, you have to wait till the bar to get out. You, you don't want to give me your name? You see that, citizens? <laughs> uh, corruption in the courthouse at the United States District. Huh? The who? No, he's the uh, front security in this uh, courthouse. They are sec it's a security firm. Oh, yeah, I got it right here. I'm pretty sure they saw the last one. That's why they're saying what they're saying now. He talking to the marshals now. He can talk all he want to, but we can go right back on Capitol Hill again and do this all over again. No, I'm here to do business. I'm not here to go in any of the court uh, courtrooms. How you doing, Marshall? Good morning. How you doing? Can I get your name and badge number? Henry Alvarado, okay. badge number 3142. Okay. This is from Homeland Security. This is L Department L of Justice. L listen to me. This is the Department okay. of Justice also. Listen to me. I'm not going no, in anything. If you're going to talk not... to me like that, then I'm going to walk away and you can leave the building. Now, I'm if you here talk to be respectful. I'm here to do business. I'm here to do business. I'm not going in any of the courtrooms. The last time I came here, I filed a lawsuit and the clerk of the court took all nine summons and affidavit out of the, the, the jacket. We're in uh, uh, Richmond, Virginia right now, and we're down at the uh, Department of Justice and the Judicial Ethics Committee because these people took the, the documents out of my lawsuit. I'm here to record. Last time I walked in here with my body camera on and I recorded it. Now I'm going to do it openly because I went down and I got this memo saying we can go into any courtroom. As long as we don't go into the court, some uh, 
restricted area, and I'm here to do business. I'm hold on, look. I'm here to file another lawsuit. Well, you could file it. You could turn off your stuff. No, go sir. To court and t- well, then you can't come in. And this memo, you have to get a memo from the court itself. Oh, you denied me access yes, to the court. Okay. You can call the FBS. Okay, I'll, I'll wait for them to come. Yeah, have a good day. All right. I need you guys to call them. I'll wait outside. I don't have a problem with that. I'll wait outside. Are you going to call the security? uh, Okay, I'll wait for them outside. Now they're uh, saying that they don't. This is what the corruption is about this courthouse. They don't want you to fail. I'm going to step out here and wait for them to come. To record in a courthouse. In a courthouse. So go call them. I pay for this courthouse. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the corruption that's going on in America today. That these individuals cover up for these corrupt judges. They took all these documents out. And now these individuals are the front line of defense for the new terrorists in America. He's going to tell me I can't bring no cameras in. No sign on this door saying that. No sign saying that. I can't record anywhere. There's zero that no cameras are allowed in this building. Okay? None. Huh? I got my camera in my hand. No, he said you can't bring no cameras in the courthouse. No, I'm not gonna. No, I'm not gonna hide anything. The last time I came in here, my body camera was on. Okay, this time I'm not hiding anything. I have a right to record my business in this courthouse. This is a federal tax-funded courthouse. You know. And if not, I go. I go back on Capitol Hill. They, what they do is they're hiding. There's not one sign in here say you can't record in the public areas or bring cameras into this place. We pay, for, we pay for this building. You know, but there's so much corruption going on. And I go right down on Capitol Hill and make it known and then to the Department of Justice too. This is total corruption that's taking place in these courthouse. This is how they could take shit out your uh, your lawsuits and whatever, and nobody ever know anything about it. Huh? Yeah, you don't have any proof of it. It's your word against theirs, and they're going to go with the clerk's word every time. So this time, I'm recording my interaction with them, my documents, putting my documents in this courthouse. I'm not going into the courtrooms. I'm recording my business in this courthouse. If not, I'll go down to Capitol Hill and tell them I'm being denied access to my building, which I pay for in taxes, to file a lawsuit against some criminal activity. You can call whoever you want to call. We talked to the marshals the last time. He talking about talk to him any kind of way. Man, get your little short, dumb ass out my face. This is what goes on. You think you got to talk to them a certain kind of way to get something done around here. I'm not being pleasant about anything. First of all, He said he has nothing to do with it. Okay, then call DHS. This is a DHS memo. So, He go, he go in there. What they did was he go up there and talk to the man first 
and try to get him. You know, that's what the whole thing is. They talk to him to try to sway things and scare people. You're not swear, scaring me not one bit. He gonna tell me you got to wait outside. I got I got to talk to him a certain kind of way to get service for my servant. Get the fuck out of here. Department of Homeland Security, they're going to call DHS, which is and this memo comes from the Department of Homeland Security. Come on, man. If they wanted to took all the documents the last time, I wouldn't even have to go through this. I tell you what, I'll call DHS. Let me see. They got a telephone them on this thing. Huh? It's the Dep Homeland Security, uh, DHS Homeland Security. All right, I'm going in here. Okay, you might as well come uh, uh, lock me up then, because I'm going in here to do business in this courthouse, my courthouse. I'm not going in anybody's courtroom. I'm not taking nobody else. I'm recording my business in this courthouse. They got mad because they uh, got caught on my YouTube channel and they saw it on my YouTube channel. That's what he's saying. That's why they're talking about no cameras allowed in here. Not one sign says we can't record in this building, on this building, in the public area. So let's do it. Because I'm not going to sneak up in here is why I asked them. I didn't sneak the last time. The back, the camera was just on. I didn't turn it off. I'm not going to sneak in here this time. I got my camera. Okay. This courthouse is a corrupt courthouse, y'all. I'm letting you know that. And these guys is the ones who are the first line of defense to keep everybody out so they could do what they want to do when they want to do it, Americans. And that is, it, it shouldn't. As long as I'm in the public areas, I have a right to walk around this. If I'm doing business in this, I have a right to do it. And now they're stopping us in the federal courthouse in Greenbelt, Maryland, saying you're not allowed to be in the public area and recording your business transactions inside this courthouse. I'm here today to file a lawsuit, and they're saying you can't come in there and record your business. Where is justice? There is no justice in this country no more. This is what's going on. These criminals put these first line of defense up so that citizens can't get it or they can try to intimidate citizens that this is not what it's going to be. That's fine. I know where the, the Rayburn buildings and the Judicial Ethics Committee, the Department of Justice and the FBI is. Okay. This is a memo from DHS saying I can't go into this courthouse and record my transactions. Let me see. Let me see if they call. I'm going to call. Department of Homeland Security.
DHS police in the state of Maryland. Contact information for DHS in the state of Maryland. Department of Homeland Security contact information in the state of Maryland. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Uh, I need a, DH, uh, a DHS officers at 6500 Cherry Lane, the federal courthouse in Greenbelt, Maryland. Um, I'm trying to go in here and file a lawsuit, and I'm being denied access because I'm recording uh, my business and my action within this courthouse in the public areas, and the security in the front won't let me in. I have a protective service that they'll be able to Okay, is it possible you federal protective service? Yes. All right. Do you have can you transfer me over to them? Transfer you over. Thank you very much. This is Federal Protective Service, and the phone is just ringing. So let's give them a few more minutes to see if they call. If they call. Federal Protective Agency in the state of Maryland. Yes, sir. I, I would like uh, a couple of your officers to come to 6500 Cherry Lane, the federal courthouse. I'm being denied access to this courthouse. Um, okay, yep. There's, there's a couple officers heading there now. Okay, thank you very much. Thanks. They say they got a couple officers coming here now. Huh? 
Yeah. Okay, so they call. I just want to make sure they call. They say they come in here. This is the cover up that takes place in these courthouses. As long as I'm not going inside the courtroom, there should be no problem. I, I'm, I'm in the public area. I'm recording my business with this courthouse. Huh? If not, I just go back up on Capitol Hill. I wish I had my tripod with me. He told me you can't, I'm not past a secure area. I could stand in there all day long, as long as I'm not past the secure area. They don't, they don't brought more security out at the front desk. This is how cr criminals and terrorists do. We fund this building. We pay for everybody in there. And then they stop you at the front door saying, you can't come into something we pay for as taxpayers. Even though we have a memo saying that we can record inside in the public areas. I'm being denied the use of the federal courthouse to file a lawsuit in the federal courthouse. Ain't this some shit in America, y'all? They pick and choose who they let in and how they let them in. It is not illegal to record in the public areas of this courthouse. I'm doing my business in this courthouse I'm filing a lawsuit and I'm being denied service to redress my grievance in my own courthouse. Ain't that some shit, y'all? This is what America is becoming, a third world country. Not one sign in there says you can't record in this courthouse. No recording in the courthouse in the public areas. I'm not going into restricted areas. I'm staying and doing recording of my business in this courthouse, and I'm being denied access because they got caught before taking these nine summons and affidavit out of this court case, and now they got caught. Now they want to make sure that no cameras, and there's zero sign that says that when you come into this courtroom or this courthouse. 
because it's an illegal uh, request. Yeah, I got the letter right here from Homeland Security. No, it's not sad. It's just what the, how America has become now. You know, I, I went down to the public defender's office yesterday and they had to get my social security number to contact unemployment to get a public defender to fight on this ridiculous case of disorderly conduct. Ain't that some shit? We had to wait for the unemployment office to call back the public defender's office so that they can say that we can use the public defender's office. We pay for the public defender's office through our taxes. And yet and still, we got to jump through hoops to get the service from these individuals. This is a corrupt courthouse. Our system of justice has become corrupt. Now the supervisor who was supposed to be the super, he was here when I first came in through the door. Then the other one gonna talk shit. I, I, I'm not up under your custody slam. And even if I was, you're not gonna talk to me any kind of way. You fucking work for me, I don't work for you. The, the guy walked over there to them already and, and, and made a statement to him. So he already made up his mind how he going to roll anyway. That's how they do. They stick together. Look at all I'm looking over here at me. They must be thought I was going to leave because it, it's raining out here. I'm not going nowhere. I'm going to file this lawsuit today. There's not one sign in this courthouse that says you can't record in the public areas. You can't bring cameras in here. It has a little sign that says about weapons.